Okay, serious question. How many times have you seen a video pop up on your YouTube homepage about this thing called affiliate marketing? More than you can count, I'm sure. And at the same time, you've probably watched a bunch of those videos thinking, hmm, maybe I should get started with this thing. It seems pretty simple, right? Wrong, stop. Don't move any further. <laughs> I'm gonna show you in this video, not only why this old way of affiliate marketing is dead going into 2023 and how you can use the new and improved version of affiliate marketing to make upwards of $20,000 a month, all without ever having to own your own business, product service, or all the complexities that go along with that. Let's talk about it. Welcome to the Remote Closing Academy. So what we're gonna do in this video is just break down two main things. Number one is we're gonna go over some of the differences between the outdated way of affiliate marketing versus this new way. And then number two is if you do decide that you wanna venture into the best way, in my opinion, of affiliate marketing moving into the new year, we're gonna go over exactly how it works and how you can get started. So let's go ahead and jump over to the iPad here so we can break down the old way of affiliate marketing versus what we're calling is the new high ticket affiliate marketing. And every Thing we're going over here these five aspects are taking into consideration the quickest way to success so that'll make sense in a second we'll kind of explain it a little bit more so if we're starting off with the old wave affiliate marketing and ramp time ramp time essentially means the amount of time that it takes to see success and start making money with old with the old affiliate marketing i think it's a lot quicker on this side of it just being honest because it's been around for so long right since like 1985 i was doing some research and there's a ton of training a ton of resources a lot of youtube videos a lot of people talking about it on on the other side of things though, with a high ticket affiliate marketing, because it's so new is there isn't as much training behind it. Thus, you're going to have to do a little bit more of the searching and finding this information. If you don't go through like a training program or anything like that. Also with, when it comes to building, uh, just the high ticket affiliate marketing is you're more of building out a, a high value skill set as opposed to with all the training that is with the old way of doing things is there's already kind of like a path laid out for you. So all that stuff considered, you know, ramp time being quicker with the old way of affiliate marketing, we're going to give that to the, the old way uh, in terms of ramp time. Now, if we look at the next thing here in terms of profit margins, again, this basically is breaking down the amount of money that you're making after all expenses, after you're putting money in ads and things like that. So with the old way, again, taking into consideration the quickest way of success, you are going to need to put money into advertising, into influencer marketing, getting the best softwares and the best, um, you know, yeah, just the best softwares out there in order to see the most success with the old way of affiliate marketing. Now, the cool thing about the high ticket affiliate marketing is the fact that there is no expenses. You are basically taking home the cash that you make from the high ticket affiliate marketing because the companies that you partner up with on this side of things, they are going to front the money in order to generate new clients into the pipeline. So instead of, again, you having to put that money up front is the companies you partner with are going to do that. So the easiest way to put that again, old, is the no and check for, I mean, you don't have any expenses. It's all cash in your pockets, which is a great thing. So jumping into the next part here, which is the commission per sale, commission per sale, again, the amount of money that you're making off of every sale that you make through that product. Now I'd say, and this isn't all across the board, but I'd say on average, you're probably going to sell, you know, affiliate products that are anywhere from, you know, a dollar to $100 and industry standard, uh, at least, you know, most places you're going to get about 10% of that, right? Every time you make a sale. So we're looking at about 10 cents to about $10 per sale. Now that's not terrible, right? But you have to take into consideration, okay, what are you trying to do? What is the goal? Is the goal to replace your, you know, your income at a full-time job? In that case, I mean, if you look at that, you're gonna have to make hundreds, if not thousands of sales to do so. If we're looking at, and as the name suggests, right? High ticket affiliate marketing is we're looking at the minimum of, you know, $1,000 per product up into even 25,000 for a single product. Obviously, if you do the math of 10%, I mean, you can be making anywhere, you know, let's say from, you know, $100 to $2,500 per sale. Now I'd say on average, you're probably going to sell something in the five to $10,000 range. So that's going to range anywhere from 500 to about a thousand dollars you're going to make per sale. But that's a huge difference from, you know, if you look at 500 versus, you know, 10 cents to, to $10 that you're making off of those. So with that alone, I mean, we're obviously going to give high ticket affiliate marketing is going to win on that aspect. So next up we have saturation, which is essentially how competitive or how saturated the market is in terms of the amount of people that are trying to do that business model. Now, a really simple way of looking at this is, well, the fact that it's been around since like 1985, the first times of people doing it, that's like your first telltale sign. But if you look at, I mean, if you just search on Google or YouTube, affiliate marketing, how many thousands of people are not only making videos about it, but hundreds of thousands of videos that are out there about affiliate marketing. All that means is there's tens, if not hundreds of thousands of people that are trying to jump into the affiliate marketing game. Now, if we look at the high ticket affiliate marketing space, is this is something that's really been around 
around for the last two or three years. I mean, we're talking about an industry that started at like a $3.2 billion year industry. I think it was in 2020 up into 2025. It is going to be a $325 billion a year industry. So the growth is there. It just hasn't really necessarily hit that point where a lot of people know about it. So if we're just basing it 100% off the saturation, because the old way has been around for so long and the new way there really isn't that much competition. It's almost the easiest way to get started with making money online, considering some of these other things here. And last but not least guys, let's talk about startup capital. So like we said earlier, you know, the quickest way to success, if you wanted to just like kind of crawl your way and maybe take, you know, six months to a year to start making money with the old way of affiliate marketing, you don't necessarily have to put money into it. But again, we're talking about the quickest way to success. So you almost every single time need to put startup capital into it to invest in the best softwares, to invest in the best, you know, mentorship programs, invest in the best, really everything across the board in order to see that quick success. Now, when it comes to high ticket affiliate marketing, very similar to what we talked about earlier with the profit margins is there is no startup capital. You can literally go to some of these businesses that are actively looking for you to help them promote their product. Is there like begging people at this point? A couple of weeks ago, we had an event with some of our higher level clients that are looking specifically for these people to jump into the high ticket affiliate marketing space. And there was over 300 companies that are doing well over 200, 300 grand a month that are begging to find these people. And they're not asking you to put money, uh, you know, any money up front because they need you, right? The supply is all the way down here. The demand is up here. So that means you don't have to pay anything to get started with high ticket affiliate marketing. So obviously we're going to go ahead and give that win to high ticket affiliate marketing because you have startup costs versus no startup costs, which I mean, we're obviously going to give the win to high ticket affiliate marketing. Now at this point, you're probably looking at this graph and saying, okay, Aaron, there's four green checks on a high ticket affiliate marketing. Obviously I need to know more about how I can get started with it because there isn't a ton of competition and it's, I mean, obviously you're making a ton more per sale. Well, you're in luck because I put together another diagram to really explain it to you guys. And if you haven't figured it out at this point, high ticket affiliate marketing, another word for it is remote closing. I mean, you're watching us on the remote closing Academy. This says closing. I promise. <laughs> Let's just break this down in the easiest way possible. Remote closing or high ticket affiliate marketing is instead of working with these companies that have really low price products to where you're not really making a ton per sale is you're partnering with already established business owners that have products that have proven products more importantly, and that have people that are seeing amazing successes with their programs. So what you're going to do, and, and I put, you know, you here, but let's break this down. So essentially whatever the person is selling, let's say their product is a weight loss program, right? What they're going to do is usually they'll have some sort of advertisement that they'll, you'll see on Facebook, on Instagram, whatever it may be. What's going to happen is the end user is going to opt in. They're going to put their name, phone, number, and email into this advertisement to watch a webinar, right? This webinar, this video, whatever it is, the person is going to watch that. And at the end of that video, it will usually have some sort of option for them to book a call, to learn more about their weight loss program or whatever it may be. So what happens is they then watch the video, they go into book a phone call. And because these business owners are already super busy, they don't have time to take all these phone calls. So this is where you come in, right? This is where you as the remote closer or the high ticket affiliate marketer come in, you take that phone call and you bring the person and you help enroll them into that program. So let's say you do successfully enroll someone in and you know, the product is $5,000, right? Which is kind of in the middle of what most of these products are. You're going to make on average as a remote closer, you're going to make 10% of that, which equals about $500. And that is every single time you make a sale. So, you know, you, if you've seen some of the interviews on our YouTube channel, you've seen people make 30, 70, 90, $9,000 in a single month is because they take this number and it's compounding on itself, right? They're closing multiple deals every single month, multiple tens of deals every single month to get that point here. Now guys, I can sit here all day long and talk about remote closing or the new way of high ticket affiliate marketing. But if you click the video on screen now, it's going to bring you through an entire training video that goes step-by-step step exactly what remote closing is, how you can use it to use this one high value skill to make 15 to $20,000 a month and the entire process behind it. So click the video on screen and hope Hopefully now, you know, the old way of affiliate marketing is out. New way is in. Go check out the video. We'll see you on the other side.